Hello guys, uh, today's video uh, is about a request from uh, from the YouTube subscriber. Um, so it's from Ruff. So uh, in this request, uh, so there will be a zip file uh, which contains three Excel files in, in it, and uh, we're going to. Uh, Convert. We're going to un unzip the uh, the zip file and convert the Excel file to Google Sheet. So this is our target for this project. Okay, uh, I, I already have uh, have this done. So this is the tool, and uh, here I have a zip folder, and there will be a zip file test zip file here. So let's try to run this uh, this function to see if the zip file can be unzipped. Script editor. Okay, let's run zip zip file function. It's pretty slow. Okay, I think it's done. Okay, three files in this file in this zip file. Okay, so and the file is not is not is in the Excel format anymore. It's a Google Sheet format. So let me delete these files and uh, I'll show you how to do this in App Script. Let's create a new document. Let's rename it uh, and zip files on Google Drive. Okay. Uh, here I will have the I want to collect the folder ID, the zip file folder ID. So, so in this cell B1, I will rename it to folder ID. And uh, I will copy this folder, not this, not this folder, in this zip folder. So I'm going to copy the ID. Okay. Let's go to the script editor. And we name this project and zip files. Hmm, it's kind of slow. So first, I need to build the UI element. So this first on open for UI app. Okay, UI UI dot create menu. Uh, this menu will be quite like I will call it JS Google Apps Google Apps Script and uh, add an item. So this item will be and zip. The name will be the function name will be and zip files. Okay. I have to uh, save this first. So 
now I'm going to build this and this file function function and uh, here uh, so what we are going to do here uh, the first step step first is to so first step we're going to locate the the file so locate the zip file here so we have a photo ID here so it's locate locate the zip file and the step two uh, step will step to will unzip the unzip the zip file. Step three here will be uh, convert the Excel file to Google Last step. Uh, so move as uh, Google Sheet to destination destination folder and uh, delete the original files from from the root from the root root drive. Okay. So basically. Uh, this function will do all these four uh, all these four steps. So the first step to locate the zip file, we have get the, the folder ID. Okay, so for folder ID will be as referenced to the, the worksheet first. So for so worksheet suppression okay suppress talk gap active photo ID will be as as talk at range I think got a range remember I named the range as a uh, photo ID right so here I have a name for ID and get the value of this ID of this of this range of this cell. Okay, so here's a, the folder ID. I got the folder ID, and I need to get the folder. Let me name Z folder. So try. I'm going to use this drive uh, drive uh, app, app uh, API to find. I think you get. Get folder by ID, I see. Yes, get folder by ID. And this ID is folder ID. So I got the folder. And I'm going to get all the files in this folder. Files will be Z folder. Get files. Okay, all files. So you need to reference all the files. And then we're going to uh, loop through this uh, all these files to find this zip file. Maybe some, uh, maybe uh, in this example, I only, ho I only have one file in this folder, but uh, maybe you we're going to have more more files. I mean, not every file is a zip file. Okay, uh, let's do a while loop. Files has next. File files next the file name file to get name. Uh, I think I don't need the name. I need I need the type the file type. I do get type, not get type. Uh, I think it's get something. Yes, get is uh, get this one. Okay. 
and see uh, what it looks like what the file type of this zip I don't really I don't I don't really know it so let's do a lot file type okay let's try to I try to run this file uh, this function uh, and zip file function I'm going to run it So it's the first time to run. Hello. It's pretty pretty slow. Okay, let's check the log. So okay, this is uh, the file type for a zip file. Let's copy this one, and uh, I'm going to for zip type. So here we're going to check if the file is if we, if the file to check the file if the file is a zip or not. So if file type is a zip file is a zip file okay so we are going to do uh, the rest so we're going to do the the step two right i'm going to unzip the file okay let's cut this one here so to unzip this file we need to uh, so okay, we need to use a function called uh, I think I need to show show you the the API documentation. So actually I don't remember every, everything. So if I have something I don't know, I can remember I need to go to this uh, this documentation. It's very helpful. So we go to you can do a search and zip. Okay, we have a class here, and I think it's nz. Okay, we're going to use this function. So basically, uh, this function we are going to utilities. Okay, this is zip, and this is to nz. So this nz function will return uh, so so we return its component files so I have three excel file in this in the zip file you will return three excel file okay I have to but first I need to get the this block okay go to the Editor. So if, if this is a zip file, I need to get the blob. This blob will be file get get blob set. Okay, this one. Uh, I'm not. I don't know why, but uh, you need to set this blob. Uh, as a content type, uh, last time I, I I didn't add this uh, uh, this extension, it, it fails. It can it cannot unzip the file. So so uh, I'm going to call the unzipped unzip files will be. Use and zip. So block. So 
all the files, all the all the files is in this zip will be stored in this variable. Let's save this project. Okay, let's let's see what what in this file. Okay, it loops through all these zipped and zipped files. To a for loop, I think. For for uh, I'm going to name it um, zipped file. Um, so let me check if it should work. Uh, so I get the name. So the name of the file, okay. Let's run this. Okay, as you here you can see, I have three files, and and I get the name, the file name. Uh, maybe you have noticed that the file name uh, is included the the zip file name also in the the whole file name. So you can you can get rid of this very quickly. I think it will be so. Var a file name, file name will be uh, this one, and file name I think will be file name split. Let's see. One. Let's, let me check this this will work. Otherwise it runs this again. Okay. I think I'm split. I think split. Okay, so this is the real uh, the real uh, file name, and uh, now uh, we got the Excel file. And this step three, we need to convert to convert the Excel file to Google Sheet file, right? Get rid of this log. So here we need to we we need to use. Uh, the another API, the Google uh, Advanced Google Service. Okay. You need to use the API. You need to to enable this uh, the Drive API. Okay. So. Oh no! No one. This one. This one. The Drive API. Turn it on, and. Uh, you also need to enable it uh, in this console. So here is it's disabled, okay. You need to enable this uh, enable so search drive this one I think okay API is API enabled why I just 
so it's not active, it's not enabled. So okay, let's see if this uh, API is, is working. So you just need to drive. Okay, it's working. So, uh, so the difference uh, between the drive API and the drive, I think we we, we here have uh, we have used the drive app API. So this drive app API is the basic API for the Google Drive, and this drive API is is more like an advanced service. So uh, here is the documentation here. Okay, the advanced Google service. Here uh, there is a very simple uh, code here you can use. So here uh, here is this function so drive files insert file. So here is this function uh, will create a new file. So with this file, so this is a name and uh, uh, this is the file type. So here uh, the image is a source, is a blob, right? Okay, I'm going to use this uh, with this uh, this function. So here I'm going to insert some files. Sorry, uh, files insert. I think I'm going to use the second one. So now I'm going to define the resource and the media data, right? The resource. The resource will be. Uh, let me check this one. So title and the type. So the title. The title will be the file name. Okay. And uh, the type, the type will be, you can refer to the type API, so it's Google Sheet, okay. So the resource is done, and uh, we need to get the metadata, where the metadata will be the file. I think we have the zip, the zip file. Okay, blob. Uh, or copy blob. Okay. So let's try to run this and uh, to see if what happened. So here nothing happened. Let's go to my drive. Okay, here you can see I already got three files here uh, in this root, uh, the the drive of the root of my drive. Okay, so basically uh, this function, this drive uh, insert function files insert function will create a new file in your root drive. So our last step. Is we are going to manage these files, so you need to uh, to relocate these files. So I'm going to give a, a name of this uh, this file. I'm going to call it JS for Google Sheet. Okay. So here now we have the Google Sheet, and we need to uh, first we need to move. The Google Sheet to our destination folder. Here, uh, we're going to move the file to the same folder, uh, the same folder, the same zip folder. So I'm going to add this file to our zip folder. So our zip folder, add file. Try get get file by ID. So this ID will be JS ID. JS ID is the Google Sheet file ID. Okay. So this step will add the file 
to my uh, zip file to this zip file and also you need to delete the files in your root uh, in the root drive okay so the drive app so we remove file and uh, the file ID will the file will be this one you can uh, I think we can uh, add a new variable so root GS I think file ID Replace this one. Looks save. Okay. So I will remove my remove these files. Remove them first. And uh, also, uh, so no no files in this zip folder. So I'm going to retry. Okay. Okay, files here and in my root drive nothing. And you will, you will see uh, these files are in your in your trash. Okay, in this trash folder. So let me add some uh, Information, I think. And the file and zip is done. Okay, I'm save it and refresh this. Uh, Google Sheet. <laughs> okay, here we have the unzip function. Let me try this uh, function again. Let's go back to my folder. So I um, remove this. Uh, Oh, let me try. I think the the, the network uh, to, uh, okay. So it's done. Let me see. Okay, it, it looks very good. And it's for any users. They only need they only need to change. They only you can so uh, if you want to use this file, you, you use this project. You only need to make a copy of this file. So make a copy of this file to your Google Drive. And uh, if you need to unzip some uh, files in your draw on your drive, you only need to uh, put all the zip file in your folder in a zip folder. In your folder and uh, copy the folder ID to here, and uh, I think you will be able to use this tool. Okay. So, okay, I think that's all for today's video. And uh, and you have if you have some uh, questions or other uh, requests, uh, similar requests regarding the Google uh, or the 
I think all the Google Suite, so especially for the Google Sheet. So any uh, ideas, especially very good ideas, so you can uh, leave a comment here in, uh, in my YouTube channel. So thank you very much. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.